Site planning is sometimes called master planning or land planning, or in the case of university lands, campus planning. It is the art of arranging buildings on a site and creating public and private spaces that relate to them and designing the roads and other linkages to and across the site. I'm Gary Hack, an urban designer and planner, and I've taught for many years at MIT and at the University of Pennsylvania. My professional career has included planning many sites in the U.S. and abroad, including several Canadian waterfront redevelopments, the West Side Waterfront in New York, and Prudential Center in Boston. And I'm Marianne Ocampo, an architectural and urban designer and principal in the design firm Sasaki. I currently teach site planning at MIT. I have been responsible for several campus plans, including the University of Texas at Austin and Syracuse University. And I've planned a new community in the Philippines and a new university in Indonesia. Site planning forces you to ask several important questions. What's unique about this site? And how can I make it even better as it's developed? How can I make the place I'm planning sustainable? What effect will climate change have on the site? What kind of modern infrastructure do we want to use on this site? Can we make this place a part of a smart city of the future? How can we create lively public spaces and a landscape that will wow those who use it? And so on. We would like to invite you to take this course on site planning. It is 10 weeks long and will cover the essentials for tackling sites of all sizes. Marianne and I will do many of the sessions, but we also will be joined by creative specialists in all aspects of site planning from MIT and Sasaki. In the course, we will help you acquire skills like how to analyze a site, how to make it sustainable, how to plan the infrastructure it will need, and how to make creative site plans. We will also look at innovative examples of housing, shopping areas, university campuses, innovation zones, as well as mixed-use developments and new communities. If you're coming to the course with no prior experience in planning sites, it will provide you with a foundation of knowledge and examples that will help you get a start in the field. It will sharpen your ability to judge what makes a good site. Or if you have a background in business or engineering or marketing or some other area that touches on development, it will help you understand how your skills can contribute to the wider effort. If you have a background in design, the course will be a way to refresh your knowledge and skills. It can be a good way to prep for professional exams that have site planning components. Site planning requires many disciplines to collaborate. As with all edX courses, you can audit the course and participate in the quizzes and assignments at no cost. For a modest fee, you can get a verified certificate that shows that you've completed the course, and that may be valuable for your job or promotion or for college applications. edX is a nonprofit organization, and any fees that it receives go back into making other courses possible. We hope you will enroll in the course. And enjoy it. <laughs>